Uh, all right, so man, um, it's pretty late right now. It's uh, 204, uh, 202. Um, uh, it's October 29th, and I've been kind of cleaning my room. Um, been thinking about you know why dogs play, um, why humans play. Why, why are we so like? Uh, drawn towards games and, and these kinds of things. What's the purpose? Because you know, dogs don't need to play. Think about it from like just an evolutionary standpoint, right? Why do dogs play? Like what is it about play that is so important that, you know, they will uh at every chance want to play? Um what is it that about playing games really that pushes um humans to come home and play, 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 right? Um, and it occurred to me, wow, just now, that playing is how we learn. That we learn through play. Animals play because that's how they learn. Um, that's the purpose of playing. Playing, uh, the purpose of playing is establishing. Uh, establishing hierarchical orders, um, understanding who we are, social activity, all these things, but really what it boils down to is we're learning. We're learning about our environment, we're learning about the things that um, are around us, how to utilize things, but we do that through play. Play is the most effective way of learning. Um, wow. And this is who we are as creatures from from you know, this is why, because we, we know, we, we figured out how to play, like dogs. I, I know this is going to sound a little bit weird, but I think dogs have a, uh, evolved to be man's best friend. Um, you know, I know that because, like, the whole, like, feeding thing and whatever, but I'm talking about um, from a more, um, uh, I don't know, personal standpoint, whatever, through playing. Um so it occurred to me that we are going about this wrong in our society, that that we are trying to educate through some type of serious standard. But really what needs to be happening is we should be playing. Our whole education system from day one to forever should be a game, a playing. Like, think about it. When you're a programmer, I'm a software engineer right now, you know, and we talk about having a breakable toy, playing around with something in order to learn about it, right? Like, we just, we use these terms, but we, but yet, when we talk about really learning, we talk about going to school and sitting in a classroom, this kind of thing, that's not play. I think the people that are most successful view it as a game, as just a system, right? And they work the system, and in a sense, it is a game to them. But to those who don't succeed at it, <laughs> kind of like me, I mean, I, I like last semester I did get a 4.0, but, um, but I, uh, you know, that, that took a lot of, like, mm, right? But if this was a game, and I just had to play the game, and I could be really good at my game, oh my god. I would have learned just as much. I would have had a fantastic experience. Experience, and I would also have had an enjoyable time. We, uh, unfortunately, um, you know, we don't, we don't, um, we don't enjoy learning as much as we used to. And I think it's because we don't know how to play. Anyway. I probably said play like 50,000 times, but it was this uh, epiphany that I had that, you know, you know, we're doing this all wrong. Our world needs to change. I'm going to do it. Me and Bones. Watch us. We're going to change the world. In the future, when you go and learn something, you'll do it by playing. And I'll fight for that.